Under our headlines tonight, three men now face federal charges in connection to the rally shooting at Union Station. This is in addition to the, to the two men and two teens who are, are already facing local charges. Shots were fired as the Chiefs victory rally wrapped up just about a month ago. Lisa Lopez Galvan was killed and 22 others were shot. And today we learned, according to court documents, 12 people pulled out guns and at least six fired their weapons. So now we're joined by KSHB 41 News investigator Cameron Taylor, who's been digging into these latest charges. And Cameron, what have you learned? Well, Sarah, we're learning why federal investigators and the U.S. Attorney's Office are now involved. Now, before we get to that, Kansas City Police recovered several guns, spent shell casings, and other pieces of evidence from the scene. 22-year-old Fado Manning, 21-year-old Ronnell Williams, and 19-year-old Chaylin Groves are facing federal charges. Now, federal court records say police discovered a loaded 223 caliber pistol along a wall with a backpack next to two AR-15 style guns and other backpacks. The documents say the pistol was in the fire position and may have fired several rounds before it was abandoned. Court records say one of the suspects, Manning, bought the pistol from a local gun store in August of 2022. He is accused of illegally trafficking dozens of guns. The second gun recovered from the scene was a 300 caliber pistol. Federal court records say another one of the suspects, Williams, bought the gun during a gun show in November of 2023. He's accused of buying the gun for the 19-year-old suspect, Groves, who was with Williams at the gun show, but too young to legally buy the gun himself. The U.S. Attorney for the Western District of Missouri issued a video statement. Here's a portion of it. These cases underscore the importance of enforcing federal firearms laws. Stopping straw buyers and preventing illegal firearms trafficking is our first line of defense against gun violence. And to be clear, the three suspects charged today are not accused of being among the shooters at Union Station. Their federal charges focus on the alleged trafficking of guns and buying a gun for someone underage. For the KSHB 41i team, I'm Cameron Taylor.